Hey everybody, what's going on? Choose here. It is 808 on Tuesday evening. What's up? Um, I have a very kind of random thing. Um, this is some pizza from the neighborhood. Uh, and it kind of got, you know, as I was carrying it, it kind of got messed up. So it's a sausage pizza. And, um, I got some Arnold Palmer sweet tea pink lemonade and I got um, I made this today and basically it is um, chicken and rice it's like Uncle Ben's has this brown jasmine rice with car garlic edamame and um, carrots and I threw in some uh, packaged sliced rotisserie chicken and um, two cans of cream of mushroom uh, with roasted garlic soup and it is very delicious and I'm just gonna give you all a forkful now and get started here and try not to spill anything in the camera let y'all to see it it is really so good it's so savory <clears throat> oh i also have something called cake in a cup except it's in my own cup I don't know if I have a chance to eat it I'll try it it's basically Duncan Hines has this cake in a cup thing this is the vanilla bean flavor it comes like, like four packets to a box and you just use water or milk I'm, I use milk um, like three tablespoons of milk and that's pretty much it uh, microwave it for like 10 minutes Oh, sorry, I'm sorry. A minute and ten seconds, and then just let it cool for two. Mm -mm. Mm. It's that good. So, hope you guys have been well. I realized that two days ago, my channel turned four. <laughs> I totally forgot about it. I'll do a proper thank you maybe in another video where I'm showing my face mm, well. there's too much light that's why I want to show it but thank you guys thank you so much for um, still rocking with me and supporting me and for all your comments and connections that you guys make with me, I really do appreciate it. It does not go on un unnoticed. And there is more to come. Well, thank you. I don't know how many views I got and all that stuff. I've looked at the analytics, but I don't know them to like, I didn't take any notes or anything. This wasn't going to be a video. I was just going to get in here and eat, but when I thought about the, the channel turning four, I didn't want to um, wait too long to acknowledge that, so. This is really so good. Mm, mm, mm. 
So I've had a low key day and my um I did go out for a little bit just to run a, a, an errand and kind of walk around. My right foot, particularly my ankle, is hurting me. It's like the, um, almost the outer ankle, but it's that soft area on top of the foot, right in the middle. Yeah, I kept walking and I was trying to twist and rotate my foot around and it kept hurting. I don't know if, if I positioned it in a certain way all day today. I don't, I don't know. But it does hurt. So I'm going to um, pick some Advil or something. I think I'll make this again. Just a few chips. I should have, I, I really need to take Take notes and do proper shout outs. With you suburbs and newer channels that I've discovered. Have you all? I posted a link for the uh, video for uh, what lovely lady eats. Have you guys subbed her? Random ASMR. His subs are slowly growing. You guys sub him. He also has a great channel. Really nice guy. Ketone ASMR. So Ketone uh, does these um, ASMR ghost stories where she chews gum and tells his ghost stories. It's really good. It's really relaxing. And creepy. I don't want to eat this whole thing of rice, man. I don't want to eat the whole thing, but I'm like, you know, well, because I will tear that rice up. Mm -mm. Um, I see that lovely lady eats, um, and you know, I, another person whose channel I like is Mystery ASMR, Mystery ASMR guy, like, doesn't eat that often. But I do like his channel. He's a nice dude. I like him. Mm. Ooh. Glitter girl, juicy tingles. Girl, I hope you're feeling better. I hope you're coming along because I have not seen or heard from you. It's almost going on two weeks, and I know you had gotten sick. I hope you ain't got what Whoopi got. But if you guys are watching and you are subscribed to either Juicy Tingles or her Glitter Girl channel, wish her well.
sometimes when there's so much flavor in the food, I feel like I'm almost sucking my mouth or sucking my tongue because I just, the flavor is so intense. I don't know. It's hard to describe it. Like I don't want it to end or something like that. It's bizarre. But I feel my mouth reacting and chewing a certain kind of way. It's really hungry. I eat that kind of fast. This is still kind of still kind of hot. So this is how this uh, comes out. This cake in a cup. It's a vanilla bean cake. Let's try that for you. You know what it is, it's if you have a sweet tooth and you might be watching one of the your one of your favorite, you know, ASMR artists or mukbang artists, and they're having cake or some kind of dessert, you suddenly get a craving. You know it's ridiculous, like it's one in the morning, one or two in the morning, you're not gonna fucking make a whole cake. That's what this is for. That's what this is for. You got that sweet tooth and you truly just want to have something and it doesn't have to be frosting. If you got some whipped cream, that might work. I can eat cake uh, without whipped cream or without uh, frosting. I would though have some a little milk or something with this, but that, it's just satisfying the sweet tooth. I like the idea because sometimes you don't want a whole cake. You just want a little something, something. They have different flavors too. Uh, the chocolate one is okay. I um, I didn't investigate the other flavors. I think there's like a rainbow flavor one where they have all of that confetti candy or whatever up in it. A cinnamon one, perhaps. <sighs> I'm kind of driving out on milk. I got milk, but I wanna, I don't wanna mess with it now. So I'm gonna follow it up with this lemonade. Ugh. So you guys. Um, a few things, and I know I've said it before, but I'm saying it again. I have a Facebook page for the channel. It's just going to choose the, the link is you go to my channel, the main channel page, you'll see the link to it. Sometimes I post little things and, you know, comments and things there. Um, so it's good to kind of check that out. If you're not a part of that team, do it. Um, 
What else? What else? What else? I'm still, uh, you know, taking donations. Like I say, anything you would like to donate, no matter how small, it is greatly appreciated. Um, there's a PayPal link. Click it. I don't have a link in the description. It's all on the little picture on my profile. Oh, so, um, what else? If you are not getting notified when I upload, hit that subscription bell again, that notification bell rather, I'm sorry. Hit that bell again so that you can um, be notified of when I uh, upload. I've been uploading a little more frequently now. So this should not be a problem. Now, I'm gonna try to keep it going too. And I meant to tell you guys really quick, I don't want to take up the whole 21 minutes. I almost <laughs> became a vegan. Now, don't just hear me out. I kept reading a lot of different uh, articles, people talking about how uh, eating plant-based has changed their life and how they feel you know, after they've done it for a while. And I just thought, man, I'm tired of feeling certain kinds of ways when I'm eating you know, certain foods. And I thought... You know, I do. I like vegetables and I think I can switch out things and substitute and then maybe slowly um, I can do this. However, my situation is a little you well, not that unique, but because of the fact that I deal with high blood pressure um, and I've been monitoring it well, but because I deal with it, uh, a lot of these vegan foods they amp up or ramp up the uh, sodium uh, content in particular to make it to give the stuff flavor or it tastes good. Um, so it's probably not uh, the most novel ideal idea for me, but I can at least switch things up, uh, different options. Like I've got, I want to make tacos and I've got these morning star like soy crumbles i don't know that they're vegan free or not vegan free i don't know if they're vegan friendly it might be but instead of using you know ground beef i can use that um and just maybe stick to doing more vegetables in my meals but yeah i almost thought because i know a couple of people that are vegan and i know they would they would be really able to help me along with that not expecting anything overnight but um i'm not going to do that i will experiment and play with items in if there are vegan restaurants or vegan friendly restaurants i will you know try, probably probably do some of those but some of those things cost money and that's why I keep hitting you guys and letting you know about the donations. Five, ten dollars, twenty goes a long way. So, at any rate, let me get off here because uh, it's almost it's almost twenty one minutes. That's all the space I got. But I thank you guys, and um, really, for four years, it doesn't even seem like it, and. Um, I like my little hub, my little corner of the world, my the subscribers, the amount that I have, you know, it's slowly growing and I, I'm OK with that. Um, it's been really, really cool meeting a, a bunch of different people and uh, being inspired in different ways. And uh, so, yeah, I thank you guys so much for continuing to watch my channel and I will talk to you guys soon. OK, bye. Oh, I'm over here. Sorry.